seen this face on a billboard along the highway. A Colorado man asking you to save his life. It is an extreme method becoming more common for desperate Coloradans, shining a high profile light on a growing need. Across the country, more than 100,000 people are waiting on the national transplant, transplant list. Nearly nine out of 10 of those people are in need of a kidney. A contact Denver 7's Jacqueline Allen found a man who has dedicated his life to helping others who now needs one person to help him. By Highway 7 in Brighton, a billboard with an almost impossible ask. I went from totally private to billboards. <laughs> Jeff Blumenfeld never thought he would be a poster child for kidney donation. First, I didn't want anybody to know. I didn't want to be defined by this. What's this? Jeff defined himself as a world traveler with a purpose, volunteering all over the globe, even writing a book on volunteerism while working in communications. I realized that you could see the world and make a difference. Now I'm a, I'm a volunteer who needs a volunteer. In 2009, Jeff was diagnosed with kidney cancer and had one of his kidneys removed. Now his other kidney is failing. <laughs> And every night, this dialysis machine keeps him alive while he waits for a kidney. And there are 1,100 Coloradans also looking for kidney donors. So there's competition. It is amazing how Colorado in particular probably leads the nation in altruism. Dr. Alice so Weissman at Porter Adventist Hospital says even though Colorado has more living donors than ever, people are still dying while on the kidney waiting list. People do feel desperate and feel that they need to take measures that they would not normally take in order to gain attention. Which is why Jeff and his family turned their cars into billboards, put up free billboards. Hey guys, I'm looking for an angel willing to donate a kidney. To and even turned to celebrities and social media. He's on a database of kidney transplant stories so altruistic donors can pick a kidney mate. Jeff's youngest daughter, Jenna, says he just needs one person. Yeah, absolutely. I'm very concerned about the future. I want him to be there for me and my a uh, niece and nephew and for my sister and obviously for for everybody in his family and his community. I want to be here with for my grandkids and I delight in, uh, in playing with them and seeing them, telling them stupid grandpa jokes. That also motivates me. Motivated to find a kidney and as usual for Jeff, it's not just for himself. I see myself as creating a template and help others. This will become my new mission. What would it mean to you if someone gave you their kidney? Oh my God. It, it, would, it would allow me to get back out there. I'm Jacqueline Allen. And help other people. For Contact Denver 7. Fingers crossed, Jeff. And I want to add that Lamar donated that billboard space as a public service. And Dr. Wiseman says after screening, kidney donation, it's very safe. You don't even have to be a match to donate a kidney anymore. Now, pair donations or kidney swaps allow people to donate their kidney in exchange for a compatible kidney for the person they choose.